Okay, we're here with Jamil Douglas, uh, last day of the summer strength and conditioning program. Jamil, uh, is it is it a relief to go to get this behind you? It is a relief. We had a we had a long summer grinding with Grizz, and I'm just glad everybody made it out healthy and we're ready to go for camp. Just, just talk about the last seven months for you. I mean, I have to feel that this had to be one's most productive off seasons for you uh, personally. I mean, you had a great uh, spring ball. Mm -hmm. uh, you come over here and strength and conditioning program. Uh, Second only to Carl Raptor in the power clean. Yeah. Uh, did you get a sense back in January that, that this, this is how it's going to go down, or it just kind of happened? Of course. I mean, I figured if I stay healthy, you know, I'm, I'm one of the hardest workers on the team, so I figured it'll pay off, and it did. I, I worked my butt off this summer. Let's talk about, you know, being this the second time around. Uh, you know, last year with the new staff, mm -hmm. maybe just kind of feeling your way around, not sure, you know, what to do, how to do it. Right. Maybe don't put up so great numbers. How is it different this year? Um, I mean, I think not, everyone's not getting acclimated to a new system. So, I mean, we're all comfortable. Um, we don't have to go out there and worry about messing up now. It's all just technique stuff. So, you know, everyone's ready to go and we know what we're doing. We just got to go out there and execute. I know we hear about you and Bradford putting up crazy numbers, yeah. but... Uh, well, maybe uh, give me some of the unknown guys that uh, you know quietly had a real good uh, summer, just like uh, you. Of course, Evan Finkenberg had a great summer. Um, wow, who else? Uh, Davon Coleman, he had a great summer. Uh, v had a great summer. Cody Kabinski got stronger. Uh, Tyler Soka got stronger. Everyone, the whole O line. Christian Westerman is a monster. So we, we all worked hard this summer. We're ready. Uh, just about an hour ago, the uh, Pac-12 media poll came out. ASU picked second behind UCLA to win. Uh, in the Pac-12 South, only uh, two uh, first place votes less than UCLA. Uh -huh. Are you a guy that's going to go ahead and uh, pin, uh, pin that in the locker room or not even think about it? I mean, of course we're going to think about it because, you know, like Darby said, a minute 30, that's all we needed to finish. So mm -hmm. I'm going to probably pin it in the locker room that week of the game. And, you know, we're gonna, we, we ready to go after those guys. We got to be the best, you got to beat the best. They beat us last year and we're going to get them.